The last time Toro's restaurant in Patterson served a patron inside their Main Street location, it was mid-March. Six months later, their dining room is finally back in business and owner Hussein Bayram couldn't be more relieved. I mean, uh, I'm so happy today uh, we, we are open. You know, the customer be, have to be comfortable like we have the distance. Patterson Mayor Andre Seya among the first to dine inside. As New Jersey enters another step forward to reopening, now permitting indoor dining at 25% capacity. Small business owners, they're us, right? They're your moms, they're your pops, they're your brothers, they're your sisters. So when you're supporting them, you're supporting all of us. As part of the guidelines, patrons must social distance while indoors. In some cases, a mask must be kept on until the food arrives to the table. Each establishment calls the shots. Be mindful, have a nice meal, and then be on your way. After slugging down what he calls the best lentil soup in the Garden State, Mayor Saya hit the pavement, kicking off a restaurant rebound tour down Main Street. Next stop was Al Basha Halal Family Restaurant, where the pandemic knocked them down but not out. We made it work, you know, we, we have a lot of takeout. Thankfully, it worked out. Now, this new phase of reopening in New Jersey is serving as a glimmer of hope for small restaurants here in Patterson, where a bulk of the establishments on Main Street are family owned. For Barham, who manages Fort Toro's locations across North Jersey, he hopes it's enough to get him through this storm. I'm telling everyone to don't be scared, come outside. In Patterson, I'm Andrew Ramos, Pix 11 News.